Hey everybody, what's going on? This is Spurly, and sorry if I uh, sound a little slow or behind or tired, and it's because it's 6.15 in the morning right now as I record this, and this is kind of, um, this is really big news to me, and it, I felt like I really uh, should have hopped on this urgently because it just w had a big impact on me, and it seemed to have had an impact on the guys in PKA, so uh, let's just jump right into it. Uh, lefty, lefty ox, lefty six four three, racist lefty, racist lefty, is uh, no longer part of PKA. Um, there is conspiracy going on that this is a troll. Uh, it doesn't seem like it unless this is their greatest troll ever. But lefties, I mean, there's, I feel like this is uh, they're they they're in too deep for just their standard troll. I feel like they wouldn't be putting, uh, they wouldn't be going this far into it for a troll that, if you look at the trolls that they've done in the past, uh, this is, this would be far more elaborate than anything that they've uh, ever done. So yeah, Lefty is, um, has left the show and apparently because the video that Woody and Kyle <clears throat> uh, uploaded to Woody's channel where they talked about, um, you know, the whole issue, uh, they, they said that it was over monetary differences. So Lefty wanted more money than they were willing to give him, and their justification was that it was you know more than the more than the show was making, more profit than the show was making, and you know with a regular business that's a reason to kick someone out. I mean, anytime you want to um, take more money than the actual company is like, if I had worked at my job and I demanded a salary. That is that was more than the company was even making. My boss would laugh me out of the room. You know, it's just not what happens. But um, that's we've really heard one side of the story. Uh, I've watched the entirety of Lefty's uh, video. I mean, not, uh, Woody's video with the one with Kyle in it. Uh, I've gone to Lefty's uh, Twitter feed. I've uh, jumped around on the PKA subreddit. I've done a lot of. I've done as much uh, fact checking on this as anyone else out there has and it's just um i don't know i just feel like we got one side of the story kind of and we don't really know the whole truth i don't think anyone's really going to know the whole truth about really what went on but needless to say i'm kind of sad um i'm it, it's pka if we're just talking about let's just talk about it from the big picture standpoint let's step back take a look at the big picture pka i think you got to say that pka is on its it's on its way down. It's doing all these things and it's, you know, making all this, you know, movement that makes it look like it's going an upward, like it's trending upwards, but they've lost two of their main hosts in the past, you know, six months, uh, you know, and it's just, that's doesn't bode well for, you know, a podcast future when they can't keep guests on the show. Uh, how long is it going to be before Kyle leaves? How long is it going to be before Woody decides he's had enough? Um, you know, how long is Merker really going to stay on if this is all real? So it's there's just a lot of uh, questions, and it just seems like, you know, for everything that's planning on going on, I feel like right now uh, they're kind of hitting out of their league, so to say, with uh, what they're doing with PKA. And I think it's only a matter of time. I give it within the next four years, PKA is just going to be some podcast on the internet. I'm sorry to say it's just right now, YouTube, Woody has been on top of the YouTube game for years now. Uh, since he, you know, not since Modern Warfare 2, but towards the end of Modern Warfare 2, Black Ops 1, Woody has been on top of the YouTube game. And right now he still is. And, you know, he's not among those you know the PewDiePie level but no one else is that's the thing so he's not you know the number one guy in the you know thing anymore but he's still on top and how much longer is that gonna last you know is when is when like the big youtubers that we saw that came up that that came up at the beginning uh you know they're no longer on top right now and uh, some of them aren't even doing YouTube anymore there's been a lot of people that have you know stopped you know from back in the day so to say and so now that just makes me think, when is this going to happen to Woody? Um, you know, when is this going to happen to him where his YouTube career just runs out? Uh, when is, is left now, what I'm curious about is Lefty, where's he going now? Uh, is he going up or down? You know, is, is the Lefty show going to take off? Is it, is, 
what's, what's going on now? How is he going to handle it? I'm just kind of, um, I'm nervous uh, because I feel like whether or not Lefty has burned the bridges professionally with the PKA guys, uh, with the fans, if this is real and all the facts are true, uh, he's definitely burned some fans. And I think we can all agree that a majority of Lefty's fans probably came from PKA. A majority of his listeners for the Lefty Show probably are coming from, uh, you know, PKA. And it's just kind of now that he's left this group, what's going to happen to him? Uh, obviously, some, you know, he's going to go upwards from this. This is going to be a stepping stone to something larger for him, or this is something on his way down. So, really, only time will tell. I like Lefty. Uh, I was hoping he was going to... I hope he you know, will go up from this, uh, from this point uh, where he is right now and the use this as a stepping stone. And I, you know, I want him to, I like lefty, but I don't know if that's, what's going to be happening now. Um, yeah, this whole, now I want to talk about just for, you know, a little time I have left with the Patreon and the PKA is I am glad I didn't pay for this uh, i was kind of contemplating it like a little bit like oh maybe i do want to get that show a little early i'm always midweek wanting a you know a new show but now uh no thank you uh the show is I'm, I'm just gonna wait and watch it like i always have and not be affected and um yeah i, I just i don't know i i don't feel like this is something that i want to be putting my money into anyway i do love the show i love the guys it's just we're walking on eggshells right now. Thank you guys for watching. I do appreciate it and we'll see you later.